All right, some of you are going to run into an issue and I wanna make sure that I'm giving you all of the tools necessary to get these, in, these pictures imported correctly. Um, so at this point, you've taken your pictures, you've had either somebody take it from your phone or somebody's taking them and then uh, sharing them with you either via email or uploading to Google Drive. And <clears throat> they've been uploaded as an AGIC file. I don't know what the acronym is, but PCs don't like these HEIC files. And so when we try to open them up in Photoshop, they freak out. They don't recognize the file type and they're running into some issues. You're not able to see your pictures. If you're on a Mac, the few of you that are on a Mac, this is no problem. You're able to recognize the HEIC file and it uploads like, like nothing, like a regular image. So for us on a PC, and again, some of you are going to take pictures and they're going to save as JPEGs and then you're going to have no issues. But then there are going to be some of us with, with these HEIC files. So for mine, I have downloaded these HEIC files. I'm on my PC and I need to get these into Photoshop. But we're going to upload them into Adobe Lightroom first. Lightroom will take these HEIC files and then we can export them as JPEGs. Yes, it's a process, but we'll be able to do it no problem. Lightroom is actually a really cool um, a program. And so we're able to make adjustments to photographs uh, in there pretty easily. And, uh, and then from there, we can export them and uh, open them up in different programs. So. Um, if you're wanting to get into photography as a uh, side hustle, hobby, or profession, you'll be living in Lightroom. There's a lot of stuff that's, that you can do in there. Anyway, so for me, since I have this LR plugged in here, I'm going to just double click on it. It recognizes that it wants to open them up in Adobe Lightroom. And so the program loads up. If you don't have this Lightroom downloaded, the app downloaded onto your computer, you're going to have to go into the Adobe Creative Cloud app and then go to Programs or Apps and then download Adobe Lightroom. But you can see here, now I'm in Lightroom. It's found this file. It says it's an HEIC file and it wants us to add a photo. We can add to an album. So yesterday I already went in and I created a Today Tomorrow folder. If not, you say new, create the folder, and then we add one photo. Previously added. Uh, let's see here. Okay, we'll just save it as something else. Let's say okay. You can see that I've uploaded a bunch in previous um, previous years. Anyway, okay. Now file. We'll go to. Add photos. I have those in downloads from yesterday. Okay. I'll click on multiple and then review for import and it pops open those files. Add to album, add to photos. Okay. So now those are in uh, in a folder. You see that it's thinking over here. Okay. Okay. So I have these three uh, pictures here. I'm selecting all of them. So if I just click on one, hold shift, and then click on, like, I clicked on the first one, held shift, clicked on the last one, or you can just shift click all three of the ones that you have. And you can right click, 
and you can export photos as JPEG large. So right click, export photos, JPEG large. It'll ask you where to save them. We'll just save them to the desktop. You can save it to documents. That's fine too. Actually, I'm going to save mine in documents because I just created this uh, today tomorrow poster. If you want a new folder in your documents, just click the new folder button and name it and then jam them in there. Now if I go to my documents folder, I go to my today tomorrow poster. Now you can see that these are JPEGs. Now from there, you can go into Photoshop and then go to File, uh, Open, or Place Embedded, and then you can find those files in Prism. And that's it. I know it's a long way to get there, but you'll get there.